Now if we accept the benefactor, if we accept the power, if we accept an intelligence, if we accept that there is most definitely a supreme principle behind this life that has designed everything in it, including ourselves, then we must also accept that we human beings are subordinate. And another way of saying subordinate, that we are subjects. Another way of saying that is that we are obligated to some form of regulation and law. Now is there anyone here as a human being who doesn't feel themselves subject or obligated to some form of legislation or law? Because if they're not, then I say get on top of this building and just jump off and see if you can defy or deny the law of gravity. Hold your breath for about 10 minutes and see if you can deny or defy the human capacity and need for oxygen. You cannot. Something even more simple than that. If you have any power over yourself, any power over anything, stop blinking right now. Don't blink. Just don't blink. Processes. Stop the heart from beating. Stop the kidneys from functioning. Stop the lungs from going up and down in the diaphragm. Just stop everything. You cannot. It means we're all subject. Are we all on the same page? So the third step, after acknowledging there's a benefactor, supreme power and the second step but that supreme power definitely there cannot be anyone any other power worthy of our attention our subordination and thirdly that if there is a power there is a law then you and I should be willing gratefully prepared to submit and acclimate ourselves to it